Welcome back. The city of Aurora has laid claim to being Colorado's most diverse city. And this weekend they're planning to celebrate that. But Aurora's Global Fest will not look like this. Instead, the celebration is going to be online. Here's Denver 7's Katie LaSalle. Joining me now is Minsu Song, a representative from the city of Aurora's Global Fest 2020. Minsu Global Fest this year, it's a virtual celebration of many cultures. And I want to start with why is it so important to continue to showcase the diversity of people who live in Aurora? So uh, city of Aurora is the most diverse city in the state of Colorado and our diversity is uh, one of the greatest asset in our city. So during month of August every year we celebrate our diversity and uh, acknowledge our vibrant international community through food, uh, music and culture uh, performance. But due to pandemic, we're going virtual this year. And I want to kind of get more into the details of that coming up, but these events, I just, I love them so much because you always learn something new, wonderful, take something away from a culture you may not be familiar with. For you, why is sharing your Korean heritage, you look beautiful, by the way, so meaning. Thank you. So I, for me, keeping like Korean culture and tradition and sharing with others could be greatest uh, contribution that I could make to our community. Uh, if we all keep our heritage and share it with others, then we'll have the richest culture and that will just enhance our cultural competence. More now on the specifics. This Saturday, how can people tune in to Global Fest 2020 and what can they expect? So we're going to have a um, virtual celebration through the city's Facebook website. It will start from 11 a.m. till 12 p.m. And we're going to have virtual parade of nations. We invited our community to participate by submitting a photo with a flag that represents their own heritage. And also we're going to have virtual fashion show, uh, a showcase of uh, traditional attires from all around the world. And for the cultural performance, we're going to have a Chinese lion dance Wushu demonstration and Bollywood dance, Persian folk dance and hula dance and the Colorado Ethiopian com community will present um, folk dances from all different regions in Ethiopia. Wow, it's a bummer that we all can't get together to witness this, but I'm so glad that you guys are still putting this on virtually for this 2020 Aurora Global Fest. Denver 7 is proud to once again be a part of this year's Global Fest. Our own Micah Smith is hosting. You can check it out Saturday between 11 and noon. Just visit auroraglobalfest.org to learn how. And since you can't try any of the foods at the festival this year, Minsu suggests having lunch Saturday at an ethnic restaurant. Yeah, that, that way she says you can try a new international cuisine and help a local business all at the same time.